Hi, Steve. Hi, David. I'm 46 years old, and I'm kind of ashamed to admit I cannot make a proper tie. And this is as best as it gets for me. I go to my 81-year-old dad to make a proper tie for me when I'm going out somewhere. I want to learn how to make the Steve Harvey knot. You want to learn how to make Steve Harvey knot? <laughs> <laughs> Bam! <laughs> I make all of my ties wider than a normal tie, and I make all of my ties two inches longer. Because when you make them two inches longer, that lets you tie the bigger knots. Because bigger knots, they just look, especially on big guys, they just, mm, they look real sexy. Charge. And <laughs> so this is where I start my tie. Okay. I started about above the second button okay. in the middle. That'll give you a little bit of width. I do one crossover. I take it through here. I bring it down once. Then I wrap it. I do what's called the double Windsor. Mm -hmm. Then I wrap it back the forward way, and I bring it down like this. I tie ties every day, because I wear a suit every day. Mm -hmm. Because I understand that women, all women, like a well-dressed man. Yeah. So. Yeah. Little doing it like that, and if your tie was longer, it would be the right length on your stomach and your chest area. Let me straighten this up for you. You've got to pull them real snug, because they sit up there real tight. I like nice dimple in my tie. And then, bam, my friend, you have, you have your Steve Harvey knot. That's a Thank Steve you. Harvey knot. Thank you. Now go get you a Steve Harvey tie, yeah. and it'll be the right <laughs> length on you.